Okay, listen, I'm having a bit of an identity crisis today and <laughs> we're gonna fix it in this video. So, I have been seeing all over my timeline on Instagram, these gorgeous, gorgeous girlies with this gorgeous, gorgeous head of dark hair. And obviously, I am blonde. And as you saw from the entry clip, my hair is on the yellow side. And basically the aim of today's video is to make myself fall in love with my blonde hair so that I don't risk it all and dye it dark. I just need to preface this. Number one, I'm in a rush because obviously always. Number two, it is Saturday and I booked this appointment about an hour ago. Number three, I'm running late. It's The appointment is at 3.35 or 25 to four and it's 25 past, so I have 10 minutes to get down there, haven't even put on shoes, haven't even left. I am sweating because it's 21 degrees today. It is not, today's not an autumnal day, okay? There is nothing autumn about today, but I've decided that it is indeed autumn and I could be moving to Australia any day now. So I'm embracing the autumn vibes. We put on a polo neck. Putting on this polo neck has taught me two things. Number one, I need to freshen up my polo neck selection this autumn winter if I am staying around. Who knows what I'm doing? I don't. And number two, I am going to sweat, but I'm actually happy about that. I'm actually happy about the whole sweating thing because I got a new natural deodorant, Joe you know the wild one that I've seen so many people talk about it, but I'm like, are you being paid or is this amazing? So the polo is intentional to see when I do sweat, what I smell like. I, I need to put in my hoops because if I don't put in these hoops and hopefully by the end of this video, I will be feeling myself. So I will not feel the need to dye my hair dark, essentially. It's either gonna go one or two ways. So let's go. Not only am I dressed like winter when it is so hot and people are in summer dresses, but I'm also vlogging in public. So that is stunning. <laughs> It's so warm. I hadn't been outside yet today, so I didn't realize, but like people are fully shorts and t-shirts. It's still summer vibes and I'm wearing Uggs. Full black outfit and Uggs. Hello, how are you? And then people I knew just saw me. So yeah, time to get this hair done. Oh my God, it's so warm. <laughs> right, okay, so this is the obvious before. I'm obviously sorry. It's such a sunny day. Do you know what? I don't care. I'm in all black. So it's fine. It's not fine, but whatever. So this is the before. Um, my hair is in style, so it looks a bit insane. Yeah, I just think she needs to be a bit brighter, a bit toned. Well, it's my fringe that's going out. But anyway, see you soon. I don't know about you, but there's something about the hairdresser chair that actually makes me feel so beautiful and like so gorgeous i've never felt better about myself you know we are toned it's kind of looking pink love to see it and the hair is done oh my god it looks and feels so much better i got this toner called shine finity which essentially is like a treatment and a toner it's a bit there is a bit of a pinky hue but that will wash out that's just the toner um i just clipped it up because the front bits are like all growing out and stuff so it's not as i would like it but stunning so happy with my decision and i am not going there anytime soon i booked my next hair appointment for the 27th of september which is a month time so i'm gonna leave the roots now grow for another it's like four and a half weeks i think um because i think my hair needs that break so yeah I came into Penny's to look for cute pajamas and there was none. Well, there was a pair, but they were purple and I don't like the color purple, so. Bada bing, bada boom. Okay, one thing about me is I am that girl who comes home from the hairdressers and just does the ends with the Dyson because I think the Dyson just makes my ends look so pretty. But yes, this is the hair after the toner. I'm just gonna go out my window so you can really see. 
there is no more yellow and orange and brassiness. If your hair salon does Wella, I got the Wella Shinefinity toner, like the blonde toner. And honestly, I just think it looks so stunning. I did take off the polo neck. I did take off the, sorry, I've been looking in the viewfinder the whole time because how could I not look at my hair? I'm meant, to, sorry, I'm meant to live my blonde fantasy this autumn winter. I'm not meant to have a dark hair. I'm a dark hair. I'm not meant to have dark hair this autumn winter, okay? And I think my identity crisis is gone. But yeah, I got a Wella Shinefinity toner. It is a bit like pinky pearlescent in some places, but that's just the toner grabbing and after like one to two washes, that will be gone. But yeah, I'm so happy. Also, look at this clip I bought. Doesn't this look so expensive? and beautiful and gorgeous. This won't clip up all my hair, but what it does do is like the top bits because, wait now, I need to look, I need to look in the mirror while I'm doing this, sorry. So this clip just kind of gives me a stunning half up, half down moment because the front of my hair, like the top layer of my hair is the most damaged. Like, as you can see, all these bits here are my grown out fringe. I had like full bangs back in April. So we're growing that out. We did, or I did nothing. Sorry, I did nothing today. Katrina did my hair. Um, and she just kind of dusted off the really, really dead ends of the bangs because we just want to leave them grow out as much as possible so we can like really shape them next time I go in. But yeah, look at me, pearly, white, blonde like it was so yellowy this morning i was feeling so drab and sometimes you don't need a total 360 in your look when you're having an identity crisis sometimes you only need a toner i today am a testament to that okay so this is another angle with the sunlight coming in she just she looks fresh it actually looks like i got my color done but i actually just got a toner okay we need to we need to blend that now behind the ear. Do you know what? The girls who have had bleach will know. Sometimes you just have to put the hair behind the ears for a few months while the bangs grow out and that's fine too. Don't mind my sticky notes in the background. They're just everything that I'm going to achieve in my life, you know? We're getting very serious right here. It's Virgo season. It is Virgo season. It's a new moon in Virgo today, actually. I really couldn't have spent the new moon in Virgo in a better way. It was new moon in Virgo today. I got a toner. We're getting our shit together. And also, I realized this yesterday, okay? And I just want to tell you a quick anecdote. So, do you know in September? I don't know about any of you, but I definitely think this. In September, I'm like, oh, the year is kind of over. I don't know why I do this, because it's not my personality, but I'd like write off the rest of the year. Like, I feel like January to September is like the biggest chunk of the year. And then September to December is kind of over. So like, Joe, you're like, sometimes you think about like what you want to do and you're like, mm, that's a 2023 vibe because you know, new year, new me. No, 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 there are 127 days left in the year. And I don't mean to go all motivational on you, but like imagine what you can achieve in 127 days. A lot. Imagine if you got 1% better, that would be 127% better. Like, can you imagine what that would look like? Can you imagine? So anyway, bestie, if you're feeling down, if you're feeling low, just remember there are 127 days left in the year. And even if out of that 127, you had 100 days where you focused on whatever it is you want to do. I'm not judging. Whatever you want to do, you can do. That's your prerogative. All I'm saying is you have time to do it and you have more time than you think. If you're blonde, this is your reminder you don't your, hate your hair, you just need a toner and a treatment. A professional toner and treatment goes a long way for the blondes. Are we high maintenance? Yes. Are we worth it? Absolutely. But anyway, I'm so glad that I did not go into the hairdresser today and be like, put my hair dark black <laughs> because I didn't need it. I just needed a treatment, a toner and a little freshen up, you know? Thank you for joining me on this wild and wonderful video. It wasn't much, <laughs> but I'm happy. I'm happy. It's Saturday evening. I'm about to chill. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more from my YouTube channel, subscribe because I can see loads of you who are watching aren't subscribed. Also, my last video did very well. So thank you for that. 
like, comment. If you're on a TV, I know you can comment, but maybe you could go onto your phone and comment from your phone. Anyway, see you in the next video. Love you the most. Bye.